Hey, hey, thanks for joining us on our uh, Run Disney Coast to Coast Challenge training. Today is six miles Saturday. And uh, it's, uh, it's cold, but not freezing. So yeah. we're outdoors and we're gonna show you the sights. Hey, so we're ending uh, our uh, six mile run. We're really close. Of course, uh, we're going uphill, so we're- uh, Uphill we're... both ways. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, but thanks for watching. Hey, uh, we're gonna have a quick recap in a bit. And uh, we have a uh, uh, kind of a surprise that was uh, dropped in our lap we wanna share with you. So we'll see you in a bit. Hey, 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 everybody. Thanks for joining us. Man, we ran six miles today. The weather was perfect. This might yeah. be one of the last times yep. possibly we're going to get to run outside. <laughs> yeah, it was uh, 45 degrees when we started off around 10 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Not too bad. Yeah. It was nice. It was a lovely, lovely uh, weather day yeah. for a run. But next Saturday is supposed to be back in the teens. Yeah. So even lower. I think Thursday shows a low of eleven. So ooh, and snow. Maybe. Oh yeah, I guess that's technically not a teen, is it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we also yeah. we also uh, dug deep. Actually, you did, uh, and I followed along, and mm. we got our stickers this week. We did. Okay. So I took a new tactic. Um, <clears throat> If you've been with us for the last several years, you will uh, remember or recognize the evolution of our sticker system. So it started off as like a calendar. So every day we would get where we would aim for a sticker for something. And a couple of years ago, I realized that that wasn't really working for us anymore. And so I came up with a new system where we just have uh, things that we want to try to accomplish within the span of a week. So if we have a really busy day, it's not like, Oh, it's not like we don't get a sticker. Right. We just like double up on another day or something like that. Yeah. So that's been working for us until this year when we moved and our lives are weird and yeah. we don't have a rhythm and we don't have a routine. Yeah. And so we're finding it increasingly hard to fill those spaces. 
So I went back kind of like a hybrid thing to calendar mode and put in, pencil in days of the week that I wanted to do each of the things on our um, training schedule. We got everything done except for um, non long run day runs. So yeah. theoretically we run a couple times a week. We didn't do that other than today. So otherwise though, solid stickers yeah. for the first time. In a while. Yeah, it's been a, it's been a long in time. In a while. And, you know, we've, we've each been feeling certain things, you know, certain yeah. muscles, like, oh, that doesn't feel good, that doesn't feel mm -hmm. right. And then uh, and then we'd run, and it's like, no, that, that sucks. <laughs> so, and it's taken us a long time to get accustomed to the altitude and yeah, the hills, and yeah. we're not totally there, but yeah. we're getting there. And, you know, it's just all, it's, it, yeah, yeah, they're Part excuses. <laughs> they're excuses. <laughs> no, I, but the deal yeah. is, like, we just... I had a hard time yeah. getting into training. It's part of training. It's part of training, right? So, so we're doing yeah. some PT. We're doing some strength mm -hmm. stuff, you know, with bands and and uh, yoga. Um, so I, you know, I feel pretty good. I mean, mm -hmm. my legs were shot today because of the work that we've been doing yeah. throughout the week. But that's okay. We we ran a we ran six miles, mm -hmm. a ton of hill work, <laughs> ton ton, no. ton of hill work. Yeah. So the. Um, you know, our 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 mile time was decent, considering... It is our new normal in this yeah. environment, so yeah. not bad. Because, I mean, sometimes we, we just can't get up the, the mountainside, so we're walking. Uh, and then, uh, based on the fact that, uh, you know, I busted my ass a couple of weeks ago, yeah. uh, coming down, we're taking uh, very cautiously. Yeah. So, you know, number of days without an accident, 14. <laughs> but, but we're, we're we're doing we're doing all right and it is getting close uh, by the way before i forget congrats to everybody who's participating in wine and dine yeah wine got and dine's uh, happening we've got some As good friends speak. out there and uh, yeah mm. so way to go everybody that's, that's great we kind of have a little fomo we do but our trip is coming in just about 60 days 60. we're going to make dining reservations for the disney world leg of our trip on monday and then uh, I guess like a week later, or at some point we make very, very shortly after that we make dining reservations for Disneyland. Yeah. So, so speaking fun. of dining, <laughs> I, our I, little homage yeah, to uh, yeah. wine and dine today. I, I, I mentioned that the uh, surprise was uh, literally dropped in our lap. Here it is. Look at this: forty-five pound award-winning pumpkin. Uh, somebody said, "You want it?" We took it. And my exact words were, I love pumpkin soup. Let's do this. So yeah. uh, we're not making any pumpkin soup today, but no. we are going to process 45 pounds of pumpkin. Oh, we're on batch number one in the oven, which is about a third. Uh, uh, I don't know. That's a lot over there. Like it may be point. like a quarter of yeah. what we have to do. So. I mean, this part, we, we didn't know what to expect, right? So yeah, I started cutting it open. And I don't know. I was I was... And holy it's mackerel, there's just a, a larger pumpkin. A ton of meat in there. I thought pan. maybe, yeah, it would be because they let it grow so big, it'd yeah. be like kind of weird or yeah. the texture would be off. Or... Yeah. Now, the seeds are about this big, which is wild. I don't think we're going to be able to roast the seeds. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> no, <right. laughs> but we are going to get a freezer full uh, of pureed pumpkin uh, maybe by the end of the day. And we were told that uh, they believe this pumpkin placed fifth. I can't imagine what first place was. Well, I mean, I think that's why they gave it away. They're accustomed to getting first place. Oh, they were disappointed. And so they, you know, well, it was a Halloween and fall festival type decoration for a few events yeah. that uh, with a group that we're yeah. um, familiar <laughs> with here in town. And then at, at the last event, the Halloween uh, community center trick or treat thing, they were like, hey, you want this pumpkin? <laughs> like, uh, sure. Sure. <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> So uh, it was either that or uh, it was either somebody like us take the time to process it or it becomes deer food, yeah. which is fine too. They do yeah, need yeah, to eat. Yeah, I'm yeah. sure they love but, the pumpkins, you know, but I love pumpkins. We cracked it open, man. It looks uh, it looks great. So uh, that's our surprise. That's our surprise. And you know, that's the rest of our day. It's part of our, yeah, no kidding. Uh, it's part of our winter probably prep. weekend. Yeah, yeah. So so part of our whole deal is we're, 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 we're prepping. We're actively because, trying to fill our freezer yeah. because... They do a good job of, you know, plowing the roads and all that stuff here, but we know that there are just going to be some days where we don't want to get out in it. Right. So and if we need food, we want to make sure we have food. And we were told yesterday that there have been times, mm -hmm. rare, but mm -hmm. there have been times where the stores close. 
Uh, right. The, mm. There was such a heavy dump of snow once that the grocery store ran out of food. Yeah, so, mm. Anyway, so, that's our excitement for the weekend. Pumpkin. <laughs> we will not run out of pumpkin this winter. We are not running out of pumpkin. I mean, we're going to have pumpkin puree, pumpkin, pumpkin spaghetti sauce, pumpkin soup, soup pumpkin muffin. Muffin bread. Hey, send us your recipes for pumpkin. <laughs> we'll try them. What do them. you do with 45 <laughs> yeah. pounds of yeah, pumpkin? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell us what your recipes are. We'll try them because uh, we're going to have a lot of pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, uh, that is it for us this week. Remember, we upload as best we can. Every week, we are getting closer and closer. We're very excited. <laughs> oh, man. And again, the weather's going to turn, so we'll share uh, that excitement with you. Oh, did we? Was that this week? The snow? Yeah, we had, we had a dusting. We had a dusting of snow. We commented on this last week. We thought we were going to actually get our first big snow. Yeah. It turned out to be a tiny snow. You know, it looked like uh, Dipping Dots ice cream to me, if you've ever Grumble. seen Dipping. But it's called Grumble. Right? Yeah. Little, uh, so that was the, be the beginning of our week. We thought we would be mm -hmm. in a winter wonderland, and we just had like a little tiny We had snow. A, a dusty winter. Like, yeah. Winter. Uh, well, you know what? Always an adventure with you. We'll see you next week.